Tom, welcome to Stoke City. What are your feelings and emotions around joining the club? Yeah, I mean, I'm absolutely delighted that it's uh, finally over the line. I mean, after a long and uh, a long day to start with, and then a few hectic weeks, I'm just glad everything's sorted and it's uh, it's all done. There's been a lot of speculation throughout the summer about what your next move's going to be. Well, what's it been like watching all of that play out in front of you? Yeah, I mean, I kind of just you know, try and switch off as much as I possibly can, but. I mean, obviously nowadays you, you tend to see it, but I've kind of just tend to switch off and obviously I've spoke to the people close to me and obviously the club and realised it was it was the place to be, so I'm just delighted that it's all done. The people inside the club obviously spoke very well and players who I've known played here previously spoke well about the club too and obviously I've had loads of messages from the fans and I felt that love already, which I feel in any club you're at is, is massive, you know, to, to feel loved and appreciated at a club is, is really nice, so I'm hoping that you know, I can repay the fans with goals. A lot of uh, Stephen Schumacher and John Walter said to you about the, the role that you will play at the club. Yeah, they've been great. I mean, it's one of the main reasons is obviously for me to, you know, get the game time and get goals, and that's what I've, that's what I do. You know, given the chance, so I'm hoping that I can just get off the mark as soon as possible and go from there. The angle, Cassidy pops it back, clipped into the box by Justin. Be a good effort by Cannon, and a first goal for Leicester City from Tom Cannon. Fernandez into Cannon. Cannon gets the shot away and rolls it into the bottom corner. I work hard for the team. I'm sure that when the fans see me play, they'll see that. Like I work my socks off, and then given given the opportunity in front of goal, I like to think I'll put it away. So the fans can have confidence. Um, they can have belief in me because yeah, I'm up for it. And how's your game developed in the last couple of years? And what are the next steps for you in that regard? Yeah, it's developed a lot. I mean, working under the likes of obviously Enzo at Leicester and then Steve Cooper now. They've obviously both brought in different ideas, different styles of play. And yeah, it's just taking little bits of, of advice or little bits out of training or like how they play that you try and implement into your game. And I think overall it's, it's improved a lot. And what do you make of the Stoke City group that you're coming into? Yeah, it looks good from the outside looking in. It looks exciting. It's obviously a young team. Um, Stoke's obviously a massive club, it's needless to say, so I'm just absolutely delighted that it's all done. You come in ahead of an international break, which means a couple of weeks until your debut. What does that give you an opportunity to do in terms of preparation? Yeah, it gives me time to settle, obviously get to know the lads, get to know a feel for the place, which is important. And uh, I'm sure once that will happen, we'll, we'll do well.